A Democratic super PAC is spending over a million dollars to target Republicans over the way they voted on Social Security. Paul Spey checks the group's claims against North Carolina Senate candidate Ted Budd. Did Congressman Ted Budd vote to cut Social Security and Medicare? Well, that's what a liberal Senate majority PAC is saying in its new ad. Take a look. And now this, Ted Budd voted to cut Medicare and Social Security and voted to raise the retirement age too, which means if Ted Budd becomes our senator, you'll be working more and earning less. Is that right? The group cited one of Budd's votes on a proposed budget amendment from 2017, and to be clear, that proposal failed, so his vote did not actually change Social Security. But the proposal did call for adopting something called the Social Security Reform Act, which analysts found would have gradually raised the retirement age to 69 and eventually reduced benefits overall. Now, what about Medicare? Well, there's more to the vote than that ad lets on. First, the bill in question didn't cut Medicare. It staved off cuts to Medicare that would have happened automatically without any congressional action. And second, it raised the debt ceiling by a couple trillion dollars, which was pretty controversial among Republicans at the time, and it's the reason Bud voted against the bill. You can see he said at the time he could not bring himself to participate in what he called Washington's spending addiction. So there's some truth to that ad, but there's a lot of missing context too, and that's why the truth of meter rates his, that ad's claim, half true. Read the full story at WRL.com.